Don't ask me why I'm watching some weird Mario Party game. We just left like dirt marks there. They just put two cameras on the back cover so that it looks like there's two. It should say on the side if they're waterproof or not. Yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy and welcome back to another video today We're changing things up. Okay. I've been spending far too much money on wish. I need to tone it down So we've got this wheel here Which is going to decide what the theme is for today's video as you guys can see We've got one dollar items three items ten dollar or less items And I did leave one expensive option on here, which is phones buying all the phones on wish Basically, we have a 75% chance that we're gonna get something nice and cheap so that I can find Finally save a little bit of money just on one video. That's all I ask. All right. So with that being said Let's give this bad boy a spin and see what it lands on oh! Phones what what ha oh come on I just wanted to save my money for one just one video now you're telling me this is gonna be the most expensive video We've done so far oh, guys Please smash the like button. All right, let's take a look and see what kind of smartphones we've got on wish.com. Oh, there's a lot of options here. We've got some, that's the memory cards, not what we're looking for. As you guys can see, some of them are cheap, some of them are not. Oh, what's this? One dollar? Oh, it's a battery case. I almost got finessed. It's a battery case. An Apple iPhone 6S? Okay, that could be a vibe. Okay, so we've got a good range of phones. 130 bucks to 66 bucks, 258 bucks. I think these are like refurbished iPhones maybe. I definitely got to try one of those, but let's check uh let's check this one out. Okay, this ha this is the Nova 6 Pro, 124 bucks. It says it's normally 5 bands, fam. That's kind of a deal. <laughs> it's still hurting my pocket cuz I don't need a phone. <laughs> it's just 124 bucks for no reason, but let's get one of these. What's the ratings on this? 4.3 stars. 238 reviews that's not bad oh that's the store ratings you know what I, let's just not overthink it we're gonna cop it and uh and and hope for the best let's go with the green i feel like i've never seen a green phone we're gonna we're gonna try that one you think they have an iphone 11 the new one with the triple cam maybe a knockoff version because i'm not trying to spend that much money okay they do have a bunch of iphones here i always get finessed with the cases guys if you're ever on wish make sure you don't get finessed by the cases because they have a ton of phone cases that make you think that it's actually the phone but in fact it's not like here for example free a free iphone 11 no it's just a case though the cases are probably not bad if you guys want me to do a video where i get a bunch of cases let me know i could do that as well but for now we're doing the actual phone all right i found a refurbished iphone this seems to be the best one i can find i, I can't find anything more than a six so i'm just gonna go with the six i don't know if it's the 6s i don't know i just want to know if this is in fact a actual refurbished iphone or if it's some kind of knockoff we're gonna get to 16 because i don't actually actually need any memory in fact i don't actually need a phone at all so we'll just get to 16 and we'll get uh we'll get the gold vibes add that to the cart all right let's keep scrolling keep scrolling oops uh oh uh that's not supposed to be there okay <laughs> jay just cut that out please 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 please, please, please. please. Whoa. Oh, Jay, not again. Man. Oh, come on. How did I know you weren't going to delete that? I, I need to delete this myself next time. He probably even gave you guys a like goal, didn't he? 50K likes and what? You get to see all my deepest, darkest secrets? Ha <laughs> ha. So funny, Jay. You know what? Let's just move on to the video. Now, I'm not a Samsung guy or an Android guy at all. And in fact, I have an iPhone, the XR. I've been told to switch many, many times. And I know the Samsung Galaxy or like the S9, the S10, whatever is kind of like the pinnacle of the Android phones. At least I think. I don't really know too much about it. Now, this says it's an S10, a high quality Android. So we're going to try this out. It only has three star reviews, which is not great, but yeah, live life on the edge. Why not? Wish t-shirts. Ah, free. No wonder. Okay. One thing I've noticed is they go ham with the pictures for all these phones. Like they actually look really cool, but I wish there was a better way for me to know which ones are actually good. Like some of these look like they could be real solid Android phones and not just like crappy knockoffs or whatever the case may be. Well, I guess, I, I guess that's the whole point of filming a video like this. So you guys can figure it out. And I just go through the pain and sorrow and empty wallet that needs to occur for you know what, let's just move on. I'm not gonna dwell on the past. I'm gonna just just keep chugging forward, okay? All right, we got the S10. 
Let's check out the S9. This way we can compare directly. Did they improve? Is it the same crap? Is it, you know, I, I feel like it might be useful. Maybe I'm just happy that it's only 65 bucks and not as expensive as some of the other ones. But don't judge me, fam. Don't judge me. All right, add this to the cart. Oh, now we're talking. Are you dumb? 47? That's what, let's save some money, baby. HD, big screen, smartphone, 4G, 32 gig with the fingerprint and the face recognition. Hell yeah. I bet this is the best one yet. 2.7 stars. I bet this is the best one yet. Run it up, 47 bucks, let's go. By the way, guys, since we're on, we're talking about phones, I know this is a just an epidemic right now. Guys, be safe, okay? You can't be having phone sex out here. And if you're wondering why, you might catch hearing aids. Get it? I, I, I'm gonna spend more money. Okay, uh, speaking of more money, I think this might be the most expensive one yet. Note 20 Pro, 128 gigs, 140 bucks. This one's a little more expensive. It's got three good reviews. Let's see what the reviews say. I don't know what this means, but I do know it's Spanish. I know a lot of you guys were not happy at me about the whole Dutch-German mix-up. Spanish to English translation. It's how I wanted to try it now. Some tells me that's not an exact translation, but okay. It's what he expected is what I'm guessing. That's good, 140 bucks. Three stars. That ah, oh, this hurts my soul. Let's add it to. <coughs> Let's add it to the cart. Okay, I just you know like the thing is, I feel like I should stop now because I've spent so much money already. But I know without a doubt, like one or two of these is gonna get refunded. It won't come through. Something's gonna happen, and then I won't have enough phones to properly test all the phones on Wish. So I'm gonna just I'm gonna keep going. Okay, we got another expensive one. Just in case the other ones weren't enough, this is the PS35 or no, the, this is the P35. It's it looks not it, again. These look nice. Okay. They do a good job of packaging this. Android 9.1, don't know what that means. I know all the Android users are cringing, but I'm just, I'm just gonna get it. Like, let's, just... I think that's it. I think we've got enough. I feel like we've covered the spectrum. We've got knockoffs, we've got Androids, we've got S9s, S10s. We got it all, as long as it comes in. So before I go into bankruptcy buying a phone that I already have, I'm just gonna end this video off and I'll see you guys when everything comes in. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the package, the packages have arrived and it is time to start the unboxing portion of today's video. I've got the hammer of doom out and ready to go because I'm not gonna lie, my hopes are relatively low right now. I don't think we're gonna find anything too good, so I'm probably gonna be doing a lot of smashing. But with that being said, let's get into our first package. First item of the day is the Noah 6 Pro. Noah, Noah, I think I'm pronouncing it right. In green, whoa, this bad boy's got four cameras? Peep this. One, two, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's got four, one, two, three, four cameras on it. How do we turn this bad boy on? I'm not gonna lie, I kinda gotta go to the bathroom right now. I feel like I'm doing a little dance move, but I don't know what that was. It kinda has a feel of like an iPhone. Okay, you know, I, 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 I have to go take a leak. So let's see what else we got. You guys have seen Narcos, you know what this looks like. It's not, well, I hope it's not. All right, what's in here? Looks very similar to the last package. Note 20 Pro, okay, okay. Ooh. Oh, this one looks kind of cool. What? All right, this is the second phone. Oh, okay, a refurbished iPhone. I'm really amped to check this one out. It looks pretty legit. We're gonna put it to the side. We'll compare it shortly and find out for sure. What else do we got here, folks? It says Model M10, first use chart. You have to charge it for 20 hours before you use it once? Well, I'm not doing that. The XGODY. I will say all the phones feel relatively good quality. I'm really interested to see what the camera quality is though. All right, move this out of the way. Last phone. Ugh. All right, this is the S9. Woo there we go. Okay, so we've got all of our phones laid out in front of us. Okay, where? I don't even know where to start. Like, what, what do we do? I want to just smash one just for fun, but I'm, we're not going to do that. Okay. Just to charge it. Oh, okay. We got our first one. It turned on. Got a little dude chilling on the screen. What next, brother? Ooh. Little animation. Looks like my old flip phone. Android is starting. Starting apps. I don't know why I'm pretending to be Siri or something like that. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoo. That looks like a headache. Four of the six phones turned on out the gate. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Okay, the graphics on these, they suck. Like the intro graphics on every one of them is really bad so far. What is this? It's straight Mandarin, Cantonese, some type of Asian language that I obviously do not speak. Now, just to recap, we've got a bunch of Androids as well as a iPhone 6, which I believe has been refurbished. Now, the standard things we gotta figure out is first and foremost, do they work? Seems like it. Secondly, how's the camera? That's kind of like one of the main things, I believe. We're still learning this whole tech review channel thing. One thing I noticed, is it this one? This phone right here is the ultimate finesse, okay? Look at this certified grade A finesse. There's only one camera. They just put two cameras on the back cover so that it looks like there's two. As you can see, that's a bold face lie. Now, fortunately, this is the only one I noticed that on, but come on, fam. You think you can finesse me like that? Uh-uh, not today. But since we're on this phone, let's open it up and see what we're working with. I already don't, I think this might be the worst phone just based off of that. Ew! All right, well, I'm gonna just post this right beside so you guys can see. This might be worse than the wish camera we got before, which I guess makes sense. That was a full blown camera, but why does this look like my beard is like way thicker? What kind of feature is this? And uh, let's, let's try and take a picture too. Ew, 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 ew. Camera on this phone, trash, makes sense. It's only one camera, they finesse. So I'm giving that a one out of five. Moving on to our next phone. I believe this is the Note 20. Let's see how this phone works. Okay, right off the jump, the interface looks a little bit nicer, as you guys can see. Feels better quality. I actually kind of like the purple vibe. Okay, the camera is way, 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 way better. All right, some vibes. You can actually see my face. It doesn't look like my beard. It goes down to here. This is pretty solid. For 100 bucks, the quality of the camera, video, not bad, not bad. You could post on Instagram and people wouldn't absolutely crucify you. All right, we're connected to the internet. Let's watch a video on YouTube. Don't ask me why I'm watching some weird Mario Party game. Like, it works for whatever this was, maybe a hundred bucks or so. It's not terrible. All right, second phone. We're not done our review, but it's already better than the first phone. The camera, I'm gonna give it like a two and a half, maybe a three out of five. It's still pretty bad, but it at least works and you can kind of see things. Let's check our third phone. This is the Noah 6, Nawa 6. I don't know how to pronounce it. Now we're testing out the video. I don't know, this camera seems Pretty similar. I don't know if it's better or worse, to be honest. You guys tell me what you think in the comment section. Let's take a picture of Jay. All right, Jay, here, pose up. All right, it's not bad. Camera quality is decent. It's actually like, it, it's it's pretty bad. It's about the same as the last one, I would say. Ooh, full screen viewing experience. It's pretty high quality. Uh, like the screen itself looks pretty good quality. Not terrible, but not great. Um, so far, it's just it's just like a two and a half again. All right, let's check out our fourth phone quickly. Ooh, yeah, this is a downgrade. Oh, it's got a flash. Auto turns the flash on. It's like choppy. The the frames per second is kind of weird. I don't know what's going on. All right, I'm gonna take a picture as well. Okay, you know what? The camera might have been a little bit better than I thought. I mean, for some reason, when I look at it here, it's trash, but the picture you guys just saw was really good. So still gonna give it a one and a half out of five. We've got our XG OD interface looks very old looking. Okay, let's check out the camera. Face beauty, what the f is that? This camera might actually be the best camera so far. And it has some options here. It says video, photo, face, beauty. There's like a filter, I guess. Blur. Oh, it blurs the background. Okay, that's pretty cool. And mono. Okay, black and white. All right, video quality comparison. I'm gonna put all of the videos that we've taken so far beside each other. They won't have audio, but you can at least see the quality of each of them and compare. I'm gonna give this one a three out of five stars. All right, last but not least, what I'm most excited for is checking out the iPhone 6, the refurbished iPhone 6. Uh, everything seems to work pretty well. This is probably the best camera. I might give this a 3.25 out of five. I'm pretty sure these are new products. And this iPhone 6 camera is still the best of all of these right here. Even though this was, I don't know, what year did this come out? Like 2015? It's pretty slow. Like nothing's, nothing's happening. I'm connected to the Wi-Fi and it's just stuck trying to load YouTube right now. This is excruciatingly slow, which is really weird. Well, that's unfortunate. We've done our quick brief review, but ladies and gentlemen, this ain't no regular tech channel. It's a tech channel that doesn't know what we're doing yet. We're, st we're still learning the ropes, but this is hot fire, ladies and gentlemen. We're making the best content possible for you guys. So I'm gonna do a little bit of research because you're not going nowhere, all right? You're not clicking off the video. You're not going to watch somebody else. You're sticking right here with me. You hear me? I was a little aggressive. I'm sorry, I had, a, I had a lot of coffee. We gotta do some research. What are all the other tech channels doing? We're coming for your spot. The spec sheet of the original iPhone. It had a Samsung-made CPU, 412 megahertz, 1400 milliamp hour battery. Okay, 
Yeah, I can do that. All right, let's get technical. I can do that. This is a tech channel. Marquise, I love you. Everyone else, I love you, but this isn't that kind of channel. All we care about is the camera and is it durable. So we're gonna do a bunch of different tests to figure out if these are durable. That one, not very durable. <laughs> it actually completely shattered. I mean, I threw it hard, but like not that hard. Come on, man. Okay, first up, we've got our S10. Let's see if this survives. Nice little love tap. So far, so good. Second phone. Yeah, survived. Okay, so far, so good. All of the screens survived. That means it's time to hit it a little bit harder. Okay, we got a little teeny tiny crack. Very, very small. You guys aren't gonna be able to see it, but that's our first crack. Jay is just wincing. Why'd you come over here and watch this? Okay, yeah, we got a little bit of crackage. Very light though, just like hairline. I think that one's still intact. The iPhone 6. We just left like dirt marks there. Last phone. Ugh. Wow, I'm impressed. Okay, the Hammer of Doom's little brother did a little bit of damage, but not too much. But these were our first two cracks. The other three managed to survive. Before we bring out the full-fledged Hammer of Doom, we gotta do a drop test. It's the classic phone durability test. Let's get this table out of the way. First phone, the S9. I'm dropping it from chest height. Well on! Survived. Next phone, or now a six. Oh, a little bit of scratch. Next phone. Oh, Nelly. All right, I think this was actually not as bad as it looked. Ooh, the front is cracked. We've got our least durable phone, folks. See in the bottom corner here, smash up all the way across. Next phone is our Note 20. Big dot to crack. Final test, the iPhone 6. Comment down below, do you guys think this will survive the drop test? Oh my, that did not survive the drop test. This might have been the worst. I, I, ah, I was gonna give away some of these phones to you guys, but if you guys still want them, let me know in the comment section below. But don't worry, I have a big giveaway coming for Christmas anyways, so just stay tuned for that. I'll, I'll give you guys a chance to win an actual brand new iPhone 11. All right, folks, it's time for our next test. It's time to figure out if these phones are waterproof, okay? And you're probably wondering, Sean, it should say on the site if they're waterproof or not. Do I remember? Absolutely not. Do I care? Even less. This is the S9 that we found on Wish. All right. Here we go. Okay, the screen turned on. Does it work underwater? Oh my God. It appears to be working. I'm impressed. I'm pretty sure this isn't waterproof because like there, there's holes where the water can very clearly get in. Like it's not watertight. Now this one also looks like there's absolutely no way that it's gonna be waterproof. I feel like you guys just hate me. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. I actually feel a little bit bad. The Note 20 just, it's not waterproof. So I'm not going to do it. I'm gonna see if any of these are claimed to be waterproof. And if it is, then I'll do it. Okay, fine. Not, none of the phones are, are waterproof. I'm, <laughs> I'll stop this test. We did it on one and it surprisingly is working. Maybe they are waterproof and they need to add that to the list for this S9 here because I still am really confused as to how it's not, but it's still working. Don't worry, I have another test. This one is way more functional and actually important for you guys to see. Looks like they survived. I think we need a bigger car. Okay, let's see, are any of them still? Yo, this actually looks not bad. I think it still works. One for one. Okay, this one got slapped up. Okay, one for two. And the iPhone won't even turn on anymore. One for three. <laughs> oh, you can see tire marks on this. Oh my God. Holy shit, the back got destroyed. Hey, two for four. Oh my God. The back of these ones, the, the ones that are glass got dummy. The front too, holy. Turns on. Yeah, not working. Uh, so two out of five survived. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed the review. This is our best wish phone right here. It's the X9, X Godi, whatever. I don't know exactly what it is, but we'll put it right here for you guys so you know. I would say this is the best one we found today. The most durable, and it actually had pretty decent picture quality compared to the other one. Still not the best. I don't know if wish is a spot to go on for your phones, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you next time. Toodles.